on the track I guide you the whole way. There's, it's very important that um, the breath work is very important. So you can try this now with me. Um, something I got intuitively guided when I was younger, uh, an out-of-body experience I, show, I shared with you all earlier, my first one, when I gained a lot of energy. So just keep your back straight and just, just relax. So sometimes when maybe you're breathing, breath tells us a lot about life and emotions. You know, when you're stressed out, how do you breathe? You know, you know you're stressed out like this, okay? Maybe you've gone for a, a run or a walk and you know, breathing the same because your body is in stress almost from, from working, from physically working. When you relax, it's a lot more, a bit more gentle, okay? So with the breath work, you're, it's a bit the opposite. You're, when you use the breath, you're also breathing in a lot of energy into your body. Chi, prana, life force, or the force if you're a Star Wars fan. You know, whatever it is, wherever you see energy, if you work with Tai Chi or anything like that, there's energy all around us. So attached with the energy is also oxygen, you know, everything that you breathe into yourself. So the breath work that I've guided you on the track, it's, 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 it can seem like a long duration, maybe like five minutes or so, for example. In the middle of that, I remind you to continue breathing, and I do tell you when you can stop and relax, okay? But if it seems like a long time, continue. If you feel any tightness in your body, that you're breathing too much, or you're like, oh, I'm getting a bit of pain, that shouldn't happen. But for example, if it does, relax the breathing, you know, move about if you need to, and then go back into it. That shouldn't happen, but if it does, just wear of, you know, your own breath work. So the breath work is on, on the audio. It's guiding you to, to breathe in and breathe out. Now, when you breathe in, you want to imagine energy coming from the bottom of your feet, passing through your body, and then going to the top of your head. And then on that breath, back down your body. Now on the out breath, you want to, you want to breathe through partially closed lips, like, like that. You want to imagine that there's a ca candle in front of you and you're trying to blow it out. Okay, and if you're breathing all together at the same time, if you're sharing a room with somebody, don't feel that you're embarrassed about breathing because they're probably doing the exact same thing anyway. So the key, the magic bullet really is the breath work because it brings in a lot of energy into your practice. It builds up a lot of energy into your body. Most likely you'll feel parathesia, which is uh, energetic movements under the skin, the meridians. You'll feel it in your face, your hands. You might feel like your body is vibrating. This is really good. <laughs> Okay, it's not anything that's going on where you're hyperventilating. It's the fact that you're breathing, you're bringing a lot of energy into your body. So the breath work is if you're doing the breath like, <sighs> don't do that. Okay, that's not good. You want to be doing long, slow, deep breaths. And um, this is your part where you put a lot of work into the session. The rest of it, you use your mind and you relax and just concentrate where you want to go. Okay. So the breath work, follow me as I guide you. So you're breathing in and then out. So you're using your full breath, full deep breaths. When you're breathing in, breathing from the stomach, the, di the di diaphragm, and then in through the chest and then out through the mouth. So breathing in through your nose. So it's like that. 